So far, we've been previewing our web page in a browser by actually opening the file. As your web coding gets more advanced, opening with the file protocol can cause problems. I'll show you two other ways to preview your web pages. First, go to Atom, Preferences, and then go to the Install tab to search for packages. Type atom-html-preview in the search bar, and then you can just click Install. Once it's installed, you can close the Settings tab. To use it, go to Packages, Preview HTML, and then Enable Preview. On the right, I have a live preview of my HTML page. If I type a new paragraph, it instantly shows in the live preview. This is really convenient, but sometimes when I'm typing, I find that can be a little flashy. Notice we did not need to save our web page to have the live preview show up. Another way to preview your web page is with a live server. Go to Atom, Preferences, then go to Install, then go to Install, and this time we'll type Atom-Live-Server and click Install. Now go to Packages, then Atom Live Server, and then Start Server. Now I need to use an actual browser for the preview. It uses the HTTP protocol with a local IP address. If I type a new paragraph under my heading, it does not show up live. I need to save the HTML page first. This is nice because I don't have the flashing, but I also don't get the instantaneous feedback that I get with the HTML live preview. This also forces me to save my work more often. Automatically, it will reload to the right. There are many ways to preview your work. I encourage you to use the one that works best for you.